Here are the seven early warning signs of lung cancer, a coup that won't quit or change. This could be a persistent cough that doesn't go away or gets worse. Coughing up blood or rust-colored sputum spit or phlegm. Chest pain. This is often worse with deep breathing, coughing, or laughing. Hoarseness. Changes in your voice, such as becoming more hoarse. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more. Losing weight without trying. Unexplained weight loss can be a sign. Shortness of breath. Difficulty in breathing or becoming easily winded. Bone pain or headache. These can occur if the cancer spreads to other parts of the body. It's important to note that these symptoms can also be caused by conditions other than lung cancer. However, if you're experiencing any of these symptoms, it's crucial to consult with a healthcare provider for a proper diagnosis. Early detection can significantly improve the effectiveness of treatment. Here are some of the common treatment options for lung cancer. Surgery, this involves removing the lung cancer and a margin of healthy tissue one. Types of surgery may include lobectomy, removing one of the lobes of the lungs. Lung wedge resection, if the removal of a lobe is difficult, the tumor, along with a few healthy tissues, is removed. Lung segmentectomy, in this surgical procedure, a segment of the lungs is removed. Pneumonectomy, an entire lung is removed in this case. Radiation therapy, this uses high energy beams to kill the cancerous cells. Chemotherapy, this involves the use of one or more drugs given intravenously to kill the affected cells. Some common chemotherapy drugs include docetaxel, carboplatin, gemcitabine, mabpaclitaxel, paclitaxel, pemetrext, and vinarelbin. Targeted therapy, these drugs work by targeting the abnormalities in the affected cells, thereby killing the cancerous cells. Erlatinib is an example of a targeted therapy drug. Immunotherapy, this is a type of biological therapy designed to boost the body's natural defenses to fight cancer. Clinical trials, these investigate new ways to treat lung cancer. Supportive or palliative care, this is specialized medical care that focuses on providing relief from pain and other symptoms of a serious illness. Each treatment option has potential side effects, which usually can be managed. It's important to discuss these options with your healthcare provider to determine the best course of action for your specific case. Remember, early detection and treatment can significantly improve the prognosis. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.